though not always, they end up in front of the courts and in front of a justice system. And I look forward to the day when Mr. Blair is not in front of establishment stooges, but in The Hague, facing war crimes charges at the International Court. And, and by the way, and by the way, his, his Goebbels, his Lord Haw Haw, Alistair Campbell, who's got the same blood on his hands, ought to be sitting in the dock alongside him. Right. Did George say that he thought that he, Tony Blair, it would be justifiable for an Iraqi to uh, assassinate him? George Galloway is also probably the only person in this room who met Saddam Hussein. And he stood before him and he said, Sir, I salute your courage, your strength and your indefatigability. And that was shameful as well. Yeah. Now, yeah. <coughs> Tony, not, Tony Blair... <laughs> not quite as bad as killing wait, wait. people, is it? Tony Blair... Tell will, us about Dr David Kelly. Tony Blair will go back to the... If the inquiry has no power to command the presence of individuals, the presence of documents that they want to see, if people are not they on have oath the documents. in they the have evidence. The documents. No, they don't have they the documents. Do have the Gus O'Donnell refused they this have week. The documents, George. Yes, they but we are not allowed to see them. They have we, the, the public, right. are not allowed to see them. Yep. Why? The gentleman has worked it out, as everyone in the land has, because those letters will reveal well, they the won't cravens I've seen of them. I have seen them. You probably wrote them, no, actually. I didn't. <laughs> you probably wrote them. I didn't write them, George. Uh, I didn't. So I didn't you, you wrote the 45 Senator, minutes. You wrote the dossier. I write the, you wrote you, the whole sexing up thank of you, the whole thing. Thank you, George. Thank you, George. You wrote David Kelly's oh, name God, yeah. and gave it to the journalists, which drove him to his death. Lie. Yeah. Lie. You wrote plenty of things. I may have written plenty of things, George. Uh, look, I didn't get a Christmas card from this year, and I'm disappointed by that. I know you